Puzzle two. Continue. Filled with impressions from her first day in school, Lisa braces herself and walks up to the Yorvik stables. The memory of horseback riding as a kid feels vague compared to the memory of falling down, injuring herself. She takes a deep breath and heads for the stables to return Linda's keys. There's Herman. <gasps> Yorvik riding school. So cool. Okay, so this is the Yorvik stables. What a place. Well, I have to find Linda, who really helped me out earlier today, to return her keys. It does look like the Yurvik stables! Look, there's Herman's house! This is so cool! This is so pretty! Uh. Hey, hello. How are you? Right. You have a lovely horse. Oh, there you are. I had no idea you were interested in riding, too. This is my horse, Concord, the finest stallion of the lot. <laughs> By the way, were you all flirty with Josh? No, not really. By the way, have you seen Linda? I think I saw Linda a little while ago. Have you tried the stables? Hi, Concord. You're a pretty horse. I like its name, too. Hey. Is this Sabine? No, no, no. It is. Khan is the fastest horse around, and I demand to be listed as the top rider for the upcoming competition. What are you doing here, city girl? The Yorvik Stables has over a year's waiting list, so you can forget about riding here with us. Sabine is right. The school is full, unfortunately. I would love to make room for you, but right now, it's not possible. Sorry. Sorry, I didn't mean to come over and talk to you guys. I'm sorry. Ah. Is that Josh? Hey. Hey, Lisa. Nice to see you here. I'm helping Mr. Herman for some extra money. That's nice. To take me on a date? Alex. Alex. Hey, Lisa. How'd everything work out for you today? Oh. Everything came out okay in the end. Thanks for the help. What oh. are you doing? I'm trying to get this thing working again so the horses can get some food, but no one around here knows how to get a simple engine running. Love to chat with you, but I need to get this working before the day is over. Good luck. We're looking for uh, Linda. Linda! Is there any star over here? Hello, stars? There is. I'm so much better at this game. Star hunting. Any more stars? <gasps> yes! I probably even missed some in the last area. Um, who's that? Run, Lisa, run! We have to catch that person. That's not Linda. This place is a little crazy because of the upcoming competition. Thanks. We just ran through that lamppost. Right on through. Hello. <gasps> it is so much like Yarlaheim in the Urvik stables. Because here's the riding arena. Yay! Linda! <laughs> Linda, where are you? I guess I can't go that way. Linda's not over there. Could it be in here? No. Mm -hmm. If you're looking for Linda, you might want to try the stables. She helps out there oh. taking inventory and supplies. Little Red Riding Hood, don't get in cons in my way. Okay, bye. Here we go. Linda! <gasps> Look, there's Starshine. This is truly tragic. Such a fine horse, but something isn't right with him. <gasps> it's the girl from, um, Fergrove. Felicity. What's wrong with him? His name is Starshine. He has the potential to be the fastest horse in Jorvik. But he seems to have lost his willpower. 
He won't eat, drink, or let anyone near him. It's really too bad. I think we might have to put him down. Oh, don't do that. I will talk to him. Who are you? Who said that? Hello? Come closer to the box. I'm here in the dark. Star Starshine? You are beautiful. But how can I hear you? In my head. I don't know, girl, but I understand you too. Scary stuff. Please help me. Something is destroying me from the inside. A dark power. But I don't know what it is. I'm sure I can get back in the ring if someone like you will help me. What is this? How can I understand what this horse named Starshine wants? I must help him. I, I need to talk to Mr. Herman now. Okay. What's down here, though? Anything? <gasps> A star! Any other stars? Hey, there's Linda. Hold on, Linda. I'm gonna chat with you real quick. Hello. Linda, this horse just spoke to me. Hey, Lisa. Nice to see you here. I didn't know you're interested in riding. Actually, I came here to return your keys. Thank you so much for helping me out today. But I think that Sabine has a grudge against oh. you. Yeah, I don't know what her problem is. I'm half suspecting that she stole my keys and planted her phone in my locker to get me in trouble. I don't know her, but it wouldn't surprise me. Hey, listen, I need to get Starshine into the ring to prove his worth, or he might be put down. The problem is that I haven't been riding in years, and I don't know if I could still do it. Don't worry, Lisa, believe in yourself, and it will work out fine. Thanks, Linda. She's very sweet. We need to talk to Mr. Herman. We are not going to mention that the horse spoke to us, though. What can I do for you, young lady? I'm asking you to give Starshine and me a chance. Everyone here thinks he's no good, but I'm sure I can show them that he's as good as anyone. Something tells me you actually could pull this off, little girl. Lisa, is it? I'm sure we can find you some riding gear and get Starshine out of the smaller paddock. <gasps> oh, we're in riding gear. We look stunning. Well, we got Starshine ready for you. If you can make him come around, I promise you a spot in the riding school and a good future for Starshine. Oh. You're going to fail big time, girlfriend. Oh. Ignore her, Lisa. Just take it easy and everything will oh. be fine. Go, girl. Don't let Sabine get away with that. Oh, Starshine, something bad must have happened to you. I'll try to make it better. For some strange reason, I feel connected with you, even though I can't hear you anymore. Maybe I just imagined your voice. <gasps> There's Mr. Sands! Go away. The dark presence feels stronger now. You must help me. Strange, it started when that creepy Mr. Sands appeared. Oh, oh, that was Starshine's behind. Poor horse, Starshine seems to be very nervous. Lisa, before mounting him, you have to calm him down. I don't think you know how to take care of a horse. Don't listen to her, Lisa. Just stay close to Star Starshine and pat him a few times. Move Lisa to the side of Starshine. Place her in a position close to his head and the carrying icon appears. Then press the left mouse button. Repeat the patting process a few times. Um. Oh, there it is. Aww. It's okay. That is excellent, Lisa. Maybe there's a normal horse in there just waiting to get out. Try to mount him and see if you could take him for a couple of rounds in the paddock. <gasps> you lucky city girl. I'm sure you'll hit the ground faster than I could say white trash princess. Ooh. I thought I was the white trash princess. Just ignore her, Lisa, and go. Please, Starshine, for both our sakes, don't freak out on me. I'll try not to, but keep that man away from me. It's like I can't see properly. Move Lisa to the side of Starshine. Place her in a position close to his saddle and the riding icon appears. Then press the left mouse button to mount. Oh, 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 okay. <laughs> Control Starshine by pressing W for forward. A, yes, W, A, S, D. You can always stop sh Starshine by, <laughs> Starshine, Starshine, Starshine. By pressing X, start collecting all the blue stars in the ring. Okay.
I didn't mean to dismount, I'm sorry. I meant to turn the camera. I guess that's not how you do it in this game. Nope, it's left mouse. Very nice. Now dismount and come over here so we could talk. Ooh, I didn't mean to skip through that. That was indeed impressive, Lisa. I think you and Starshine have taught us all a lesson. I think it may be a good idea to take Starshine into the big paddock to see what he can really do. Well, trotting around is one thing, but that wreck of a horse is nothing compared to Khan. Let's take it easy, Starshine. I'm sure this will work out fine for us. It's strange. I've been afraid of riding ever since I was 10, but I don't feel that way with you. Hey, Lisa, I have to leave for the library. I'll call you later. Good luck in the large paddock. Bye. This is the large paddock where the competitions are held. <laughs> I'm telling you, the closest you'll come to the competition is as a spectator. So don't even dream about it, city girl. Remember, you have to make Starshine gallop before you jump over the bar hurdles. If not in gallop, he'll refuse to jump over. Go, Lisa, go, go, go. Thanks, Alex. <laughs> we got this. You can increase Starshine's speed. Press W multiple times to go faster and S to go slower. Use spacebar to jump over the hurdles. Collect all the blue stars by jumping on them. Yay! Did we hit it? I think we hit the first one. <laughs> it's okay. Oh no! We definitely hit that one! <laughs> He's a big horse! I'm not used <laughs> He doesn't jump that high. <laughs> oh, we hit all of them! <laughs> jump sooner! <laughs> We're all very impressed. Are you? Because I didn't do that great. Dismount Starshine and come over here, Lisa. Here I come. I feel something bad is about to happen. The white horse is indeed fast. This is fantastic, Lisa. You and Starshine have not only earned a position at the school, but also a spot in the competition. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> if that earns me a spot in the competition, everyone else must be horrible. And when you compete against Khan and me, this white cow won't look so fast. Oops, what's wrong with Starshine? Look at him! Starshine is very nervous again. Lisa, you seem to be the only one who can calm him down. Try patting him again. What just happened? He just oh, get over there! Oh no! Oh no! Help me, Lisa! This is what I feared. Tell me what to do, Starshine. I'll do anything. I don't know, but I feel that you're the only one who can help me out of this mess. Why is he on the ground? Let's get this fine horse back to his box and I'll get to the vet I'll get the vet to look at him immediately. I'm like traumatized. This is very troubling. I can't figure out the nature of his injury, but it's obvious that this horse is in pain. You surprised me today, Lisa. You could obviously reach Starshine in a way that I haven't seen anyone do in a long time. What do you mean, Mr. Herman? Some people say that there are special people who have been chosen to communicate with horses. Maybe you're one of these people. Some say that these people have other powers as well. Do you think I can help Starshine when the vet can't? Look inside yourself, Lisa, and maybe you could do something that we can't. Huh? Let me see that leg, Starshine. I'm gonna try something. What is that? Magic, magic, magic. It's so strange, Lisa. The darkness that is choking me almost disappeared. You're almost there, Lisa. Don't give up. What is happening? Oh, Mr. Sands pushed me. I can feel your powers, but it's not enough, Lisa. I'm sorry, Starshine. I can't do it. There's something I need to learn or, or find out if I'm going to be able to help you. I felt I was close too, but I'm just too weak. Oh. 
this horse couldn't even manage a simple ride in the ring. And this is what you want the superior Khan and me to be competing against? Put him to sleep so this school won't have the embarrassment anymore. That's out of the question, Sabine. I saw a wonderful horse out there earlier today, and we're going to take care of him, especially if he's hurt and needs help. Maybe I can offer a solution. My name is Mr. Sands, and I represent people who are interested in helping needy horses. I'm willing to pay you a handsome price for the poor horse, and you will break these girls' hearts by putting it to sleep. I'm sorry, Mr. Sands. I won't sell this horse, but I won't kill it either. Now I must ask you to leave. Please. Very well. Your passion is commendable. I bid you good day, but we will meet again. Adios, Mr. Sands. My phone is ringing. Yes, hello? Hey, Lisa, it's Linda. Come over to the library at school. I did some research and came across some very interesting things. The school library? <gasps> Level two completed! Nice. Save for sure.